Hey, Agile Coaches, we need to talk. If you are someone carrying the title or role of Agile Coach or Agile Consultant, even a technical coach, if you're in a role where people are listening to you, if you're being put in a position where you expect people to listen to you, you better earn it. We are, at least in my company, going out and telling very senior, very experienced people how to run their businesses, how to structure their organizations. The things we're recommending impact people's jobs, their livelihoods, the way that they perform, the way they interact, what their days are like. The things we recommend can be great for some people, not great for others, but everything we say matters. Because of this, our expectations are higher than anyone else that we work with, higher than senior managers, higher than developers that are writing the code, higher than product managers or product owners. Or We have to be better. We have to be better because we have to be worthy of being listened to. If we intend to coach these people and give them advice, we better know what we're talking about. So that means we have to be well-read, well-studied, up to date on the current literature, up to date on the current research, make sure that we understand what works and what doesn't, what's optional, what's mandatory, make sure we have reasons behind everything we do, surround ourselves with other professionals that sharpen us and have different skills and points of view than us to make sure that what we're doing is good. We need to be humble about the things that we don't know, and we must be almost perfect, conscientious to a fault, wise, experienced, kind, empathetic, open-minded, an eager learner, a great communicator, an expert in a domain, but a generalist in many. That is a huge ask. And it's possible. I expect it of myself. I expect it of the people that work with me. We have to be good because we are reshaping the face of business. We are redesigning the way that people work. We are redesigning the structures and organizations. We are building the future of work. We're changing things so that our kids can enter a workforce that is more fair, more engaging, more exciting, producing great value, so that our kids can interact with companies that are ethical and producing great customer experiences. There's a lot riding on our shoulders. So we have no excuses. We can't be late. We can't be unreliable. We can't be sloppy. We can't be lazy. Uh, and if that doesn't sound like something you want to rise to the occasion of, because boy, is it work, boy, are the expectations high, then maybe this role isn't for you, which is fine. There are a million other roles where you can take your skills and experience and apply them. But if you are up for a challenge and you are up for greatness, come and join me. Help me learn. Help me grow. Uh, make your own videos. Make your own content. Do your own research. Reach out and create something. Make something. Be part of this. But above all, just don't be mediocre. We can't afford it.